Hi, it's Jenny from Jenny's Favourite Products. So yesterday I received three movie boxes, but because I didn't have enough time, I was only able to unbox one of them. And so today I'm going to be doing the unboxing videos for the other two boxes that I received yesterday. So this box is the movie box Global number 18. This is a movie box Global, so it does contain products for uh, quite a variety of things. Um, they usually contain like uh, facial products, as well as some hair, some body things and just like a whole body kind of box. So they do have a variety of products inside, which I really love about them. And uh, I have actually opened this box to see what were the products inside, and I have actually started using one of them already, and I really like that one. So uh, let's get unboxing. So uh, this box doesn't really feel quite heavy. Um, it is kind of unusual, but apparently the current boxes from Mimi Box, they don't contain as many products because they are saying that they are doing quality over quantity. So uh, yeah, there are only like five to six products inside these boxes nowadays so uh, yeah let's see what's inside this box okay so um this is the Mimi box global number 18 I do quite like global boxes because they do have a variety of products and I can try out new things and also um, I don't know um, in the recent boxes I have found that the global boxes do seem to be better than some of the themed boxes especially the Christmas ones um, yes yeah, so yeah, this is the 18 and um, I do have a 19 which is supposed to come next month. Um, I think that's the end of my global box series because I did buy the bundle which came with the 17, 18 and 19. Um, I do hope they come out with a 20 because um, these are the only boxes that I happen to buy all the time at the moment. So uh, let's get unboxing. Um, the first product inside this box is the Pyroderm Shower Jelly 100 grams. You will get one which is randomly selected from 01 Brushing Milk or 02 Cooling Mint. This looks like this. So the one that I got is the Brushing Milk, which is good because I don't really like mint things. So, jelly textured beauty products are in trend these days, but have you ever seen a shower gel designed to, into a pudding-like jelly visual? Periderm's shower jelly comes in two options, brushing milk and cooling mint. Each catered to different skincare needs, yet both extremely gentle and non-simulating in formula. The fine bubbles, which can be easily created with simple lathering, penetrate deep into the skin and wash away all dirt and impurities and leave the skin clean and fresh. It leaves a nice and subtle fragrance which helps to alleviate and refresh your spirits as well. You place the shower jelly into the bubbling net provided and soak it with water. Lather well and gently massage it all over the body. Rinse with water. Okay, so um, let's see what this looks like. Um, so it comes with the net that you're supposed to uh, put this into the net and then you use it to lather with water. Um, let's open it up to see if I can smell anything. It does have a smell. Um, I don't actually know what to get out of it. Um, it says it's like a brushing milk, but it doesn't really smell like milk. It's just like a fragranted thingy. But um, it does look quite funny. It's like a jelly. It's like a, you can say it's like a pudding, kind of jelly pudding. Um, I don't want to dig my hand into it now because I don't know if I'll actually use it. Um, it does seem like quite an interesting product. Um, if the smell was more milky rather than like fragrance, I would use it. Um, but unfortunately, it just smells like fragrance and not milk, so I'm not so such a big fan of that. But it does say something which is really funny. It says, do not eat. Maybe people think that it looks like food and they'll eat it. Um, yeah. So I don't know how you'd be using that one, but another Puritan product. Well, apparently Puritan products are quite cheap to be purchased, uh, and so it's not like a high-end product or anything. But if it's good, then it doesn't matter, right? Okay, so then the second product in this box is the Dr. MJB Tox Control Cream 55ml, um, which I believe is the this one here. Um, it does come in quite a cute container, or well, not container, like the box is really cute. It's in the shape of a hexagon, which kind of tries to imitate the, uh, the shape of like a honey beehive. Uh, yeah. That looks quite cute. Uh, repair and renew with Dr. MJ's Betox Control Cream rich in skin repairing agents. B Venom, Propolis Extracts, Tea Tree Leaf Water, Rosemary Extracts and Calendula Extracts. 
It will soothe, nourish and rejuvenate the skin damaged or simulated from external environment by creating a protective moisture barrier over and retaining moisture and nutrition within the skin. So you apply the cream evenly over your face at the very last stage of skincare routine. Massage it in for full absorbance. So let's see if the inside is actually as cute as the outside. Okay, so the inside is just like a round container, but it does come with like a gold lid, which is really pretty. Um, yeah, but there's nothing much about this container. Um, if it did come in like a hexagon kind of container, it would look more interesting for sure. Um, I did receive like a hexagon jar of jam before and I, after I finished the jam, I actually kept the container and I love using it. It's just so pretty. But um, yeah, if this was prettier, then it would be like a bonus, but it's not. And uh, I opened it up and it has a seal so I can't smell what is inside. Um, I really, really love the smell of honey, but a lot of honey products don't actually smell like honey. They just look, or they just say that it's a honey product, but um, yeah, it just smells like a fragranced stuff, which I'm not really a big fan of. So I don't know how that will go. And I hope it's not too rich for my skin because I do have like other snail honey bee creams as well. And um, that was too rich for my skin. And then I started having like little bumps on here which wasn't really good so I hope it's not that bad okay so then the third product in this box is the e-choice hand therapy 60 grams and um, you will get one which is randomly selected from sweet rose and shea butter cherry rose and shea butter and I believe the one that I got is the sweet rose and shea butter so this is a hand cream um, it does come in quite a nice packaging um, although I'm not really a big fan of hand creams because for Christmas I received like 12 mini size Although they're mini size, but I received 12 hand creams from Crabtree and Evelyn um, My mother-in-law gave me a really pretty box full of hand creams um, They're really good because they are pocket sized and so I can put them inside my handbag very easily um, This is relatively small, but mine is even smaller and just even more convenient than this um, So I might be giving this away. It does look quite cute though um, infused with shea butter and rose or cherry blossom extracts, this nourishing hand cream from each choice leaves hands dramatically softer and suppler, and your hands will smell of sweet floral garden all day long. So you massage the hand cream into clean hands until fully absorbed, reapply as needed. Okay, so that's that. And then the fourth product inside this box looks like this. Um, so these look familiar but just different patterns. Um, you will get one which is randomly selected from guava and pineapple. Um, this is the Purest, Pure Smile Animal Point Pad 17ml. And the one that I got is the guava. This is a point mask pad, pad, perfect for moisturizing and soothing dry, stimulated or troublesome part of your face and body in an easy 15 minute treatment. It's formulated with a rich blend of guava or pineapple extract, vitamin E, hyaluronic acid and natto gum. So I don't know what natto gum is, but yeah. So the one that I got is the guava and um, it does seem like a good product. Um, I'm not a big fan of putting these on my face because they are round and my face is obviously three dimensional. So it's kind of hard to stick like a round product on my face. I have tried to stick the orange ones from Puroderm, I think. Um, those were iPads, but um, it didn't really fit well on my face or on my eyes because like your eyes are not flat and it's kind of like, a, a flat product sticking on your eyes is just it didn't really cover my eyes very well um, so but it's good that this is a product for your face and your body so if any of your body is dry you can just put this on um, so this is how you use it you cleanse and tone your face place the point pads over parts of your body or face that give that you wish to give special treatments to remove the sheet pad after five to ten minutes and pat in the remaining essence of for full absorbance so that's quite good um, you can use it for your body i would never thought of using it for my body actually but i think i can use the other ones for my body then so it won't be like a waste okay so then the fifth product inside this box is the dermalift dermalift intensiderm aqua rich cream 15 ml times three each the full size product is 50 ml but you just get three of these which equates to like nearly one uh, full-size product because you get 15 15 so uh, that's if you get two then that's 30 ml then when you get three then you get 45 ml then why don't they just provide the whole full product um although i mean the size is very good for uh if you're going on trips so that's good but um other than that i think i would prefer the full product or well, maybe because they couldn't fit it inside the box i don't really know 
But uh, yeah, so they came with uh, three products like this. They are exactly the same. This is the product that I started using yesterday um, because it is suitable for sensitive skin. Well, oh, I get the feeling that since it has the word derma and uh, intensive derm, so uh, I thought that it would be suitable for sensitive skin and I put it on my son's body and face and it was very hydrating, very moisturizing for him, but it wasn't sticky or anything. And I think it helped with this itchiness on his legs okay so uh, this is a gentle moisture rich facial cream formulated specifically to soothe and repair damaged skin and to prevent any further stimulation or damage with a protective moisture barrier deeply replenish and nourish your skin this cold season with derma lift intensive aqua rich cream so you squeeze out the formula from its tube and spread it evenly over clean face gently pat it in with clean hands for full absorbance so um, yes as I said we started using this one yesterday and um, I think it's quite a good product. It is very moisturizing. Um, it's not really sticky, but the, the thing that made me laugh is actually the color because it's actually like a greenish kind of color, which is quite surprising. Um, greenish color. Um, it does massage in quite easily and it does have a very nice smell. Um, I would have thought that it would have no smell because it's for well, suitable for sensitive skin. But um, yeah, it does have a slight smell and um, yeah, it's very smooth gliding on the skin so it's fine but it does leave a little bit of stickiness but that's okay because um, it will go after a while. Okay, so then the sixth product which is also the last product inside this box is the Touch by Lee Kyung Min Extreme Shield Master 2.2 ml. This is the full size product and it looks like this. Quite a cute packaging really. I don't know if you can see because of the light. I don't know how to cover it up. Okay, anyways, it says Touched by Lee Kyung Min and it's an Extreme Shield Master. Lee Kyung Min is a Korean creative director famous for her winter skincare beauty class and the secret to premium skincare fit for the colder, drier seasons. This Extreme Shield Master is a magical ampule enriched with essence type oil components for instant moisture, moisture surge. It effectively calms and takes care of white flakes and visible dead skin cells evident on dry, roughened skin suffering from piercing winter winds. So you, uh, this is the way to use it. You use the attached silicone brush tip of the ampule to gently dab the formula over dry and flaky spots of the face, suitable to be used under or over makeup. So this seems quite like quite a good product to use because um, sometimes or in the really, really, really dry winter months um, of previous years, I used to get flaking skin on my nose. So it's really a big problem when I uh, applied makeup because then you'll see my nose flaking. So this is really good, um, if it really works, that is. Um, when you take it out of the container, it looks like this. Um, inside is the ampule. And then uh, when you open the lid, this is the silicone brush. It kind of reminds me of the pore brushes that you have. Um, uh, the ones that I've received in the past is the, like the tip is a silicone and then you put it on your nose but apparently this is different um, this is an ampule and apparently you just twist the ends and then the ampule will come out from the silicone edge and you just put it on wherever your face needs it um, I think this will be really useful because um, you can put it on makeup as well as under makeup so it's really convenient you can just put it in your handbag and just carry it wherever you go and just have like touch-ups of your face so this is really convenient um so I think this box is actually quite a good box um it's not like the best global box that I've ever received but it is quite a good box I think I will use up most of the products inside my box and um yeah I'm hoping to receive my global 19 next month and I do hope they do come out with new globals for this year although they do seem to be quite slow on boxes boxes recently, um, maybe because they're expanding to the China market and they're also expanding their own Mimi Box brand, but um, they've been quite slow in um, Mimi Boxes for international, so yeah, I don't know what's wrong there, but um, if they do come out with a Global 20, then I'll definitely buy it. So uh, that's it for today, I think my camera is running out of battery, so um, yeah, so if you like my videos, please give me a like and please follow my channel at Genie's Fab Products. Thank you and have a nice day. Bye.